Okay, so uh, Crazy Joe Video Chronicles. I'm going to report something. A friend of mine just sent me a notice from California that the California Senate just passed a bill to make it illegal for uh, shop owners to confront shoplifters. Again, the California Senate is making it illegal for supermarket, anybody that owns a store or business that suspects people of shoplifting to confront them and made it illegal. Now, let me tell you something about the Crazy Joe Show. You motherfuckers don't know how good you fucking got it. Because this is the shit we're going to talk about on the show of shows. And it's in my opinion that the leftist liberal cocksuckers want to pass these laws to build an army of criminals that will attack and kill and destroy the real patriotic Americans that sit on the right. So anybody on the right is now in danger because if this keeps up, these people that the leftists are freeing up criminals, which is already happening, crime is crazy all over the fucking place, they'll say to those people, you owe us. We pass bills, we let you go, we give you slaps on the wrist. You don't have to go to jail. We'll release you from jail. Just do us a favor. Support the left and kill every American that's on the right. Now think about that. Just think about that for a second and see if that doesn't make sense. Getting back to the Crazy Joe show, this is the kind of reporting that we're going to do. And you know what? As a real American patriot, patriot that I am, who knows if I'll be a victim when I get popular doing the Crazy Joe show. So you fucking jerk offs better start fucking contributing if you're on the right. If you're really on the right and you really believe in being a patriot for what's going on with this liberal civil war that's being conducted on Americans, you better contribute to the GoFundMe fund because of the simple fact that I'm going to be on the air and I'm going to tell it like it is. And hearing upon this news just makes me shake all over because I could be a target. But it's up to you people. See, if you want to contribute, then I know you're loyal people. And if you're not going to contribute to the GoFundMe pun, which I call the Go Fuck Yourself Fund, then, uh, you know, fuck yous. You never were my fans. You never were supportive of the Crazy Joe Show. We're going to see where you people are at, where your loyalties are at. I've been out here for a long fucking time, and you know what? I'm sick of it. I'm sick of all you people fucking me around, being a bunch of douchebags to me, because you are douchebags. And just remember one thing. I set up that page for the outside world, not for you people, because I wouldn't do that. If it was exclusively you people, believe me, I wouldn't set up a GoFundMe page, because I know you fucking jerk offs are unreliable, bunch of scumbag, cocksucker motherfuckers. And the reason I say that is because I know... There's got to be at least one or two or three people who like me out of the 102. And the rest of you are just a bunch of fucking morons and losers. And you don't support patriotic Americans like me. So um, it doesn't matter. It really doesn't matter. But I'll get mine. I'll get mine on July 1st when I start deleting all you scumbags who are sitting on my fucking page and doing nothing for me. You will be kicked off my page. I promise you that. If it doesn't happen uh, July 1st, it'll happen another time. I don't care what I got to do. Oh, here's a patriot with the American flag. Look at that. Wow. That's fucking great. A real fucking American. But um, that's where it's at with me. 
being a real American. And like I said, you got to July 1st to sit on sit on your big, fat, lazy, cocksucker asses. Oh, by the way, there's another thing called bed. I call it bed wedding, but it's bed resting where the new millennials are lazy and don't want to do shit. They don't want to work. They don't want to do this. They don't want to do that. They just rather work from home and be lazy. And do you know that staying home and not going out will make your testosterone levels extremely low. There's a thing in Japan where, I don't know if it's, it's a big population of the segment of Japan. They got a lot of people there. 1.5 million, I believe, are choosing to be isolated from society. They don't want nothing to do with society. They just want to stay in their house all day. Another reason why they're going to die young because they're not interactive people. See, I'm an interactive interactive person. I'm friends with everybody. Well, only the people that are cool. I wouldn't be friends with a jerk off like Billy Faggot Painter or Eric Pitcher, the guy with the dick in his mouth. I wouldn't do that. I choose people wisely. And I don't I'm not going to have these social fucking problems. I'm not going to have low testosterone. I'm not going to be depressed and lonely. Because I got you fucking jerk offs to fucking pick on. (laughs) And I don't really pick on. I'm not a bully. But you people are scumbags that don't want to do anything for me and my Crazy Joe show. So you can go fuck yourselves, the ones that don't, the ones that do. Like I said, July 1st, we'll find out who's down and who's not down with the Crazy Joe Show. That's it for now. The rest of you go fuck yourselves. And I mean the people that are motherfuckers. They should go fuck themselves. They should shove a fucking dildo up their fucking ass. A nice big blind dingo cock right up their fucking ass.